hey guys welcome to coding simplified and today we'll see a new problem in linked list where our aim is to check that whether a linked list is palindrome or not so palindrome means that the all elements from the starting to the ends are equal so basically if you see that 12 12 99 and if you reverse the linked list so that they should be the same as the original linked list you can say so you can say 12 12 and matching then 99 and 99 matching then 37 then again so these are the odd nodes we have the five nodes and let's say we have the even node list so in this case also they should match so if you reverse this link list they should be exactly same so like here in this case you can see 12 is matching to 12 then 99 are matching and 37s are matching right so basically there are two cases one when we have the odd node list and one we have the even node list right so what should be our logic so what we will do our aim is to reach till middle node right so i will take two pointers slow pointer and fast pointer and i will increase the slow pointer by one position and fast pointer by two position until fast dot next is not null or fast dot next dot next is not null so by what will happen by doing this the slow pointer will be the middle node right and when I am doing this, when I am increasing the slow pointer by one position, I am also putting the slow pointer into stack. Right. So what would happen? The slow pointer is here. So first I will put the slow pointer into stack. Then 99. So 99 would be above the 12 in the stack. And then 37. Right. So once I reach here, this, this will be my middle node because first node has reached till the null. So once I have reached there, I will check that if fast dot if fast dot next is null, it means there are odd nodes. So if that is the case, so I will pop out the one element and then I will check by popping out the element and by checking the second half one by one. Right. So this will be the exact match. So for example, because these are the odd nodes and fast dot next is null. So I will first pop out the one element. So I'll pop out this one. Then I will check the popping out the these elements so 99 is matching 99 correct then again i will pop out the one element and i will check with the second half yes they are matching correct now what will happen in the case of even so this will be at the middle node 37 will be middle node and my second half will be this one right so i will keep on popping out the one element and matching the element so i'll pop out one element then i will match again i will pop out one element i will match again i will pop out one element and i will match so this will make sure to ch check the palindrome condition that whether the elements are equal or not right so let me show you by an example so here in this case i have the palindrome i have 12 99 37 and 37 99 12 so they are per palindrome right and let me show you by debug directly so what will happen uh, i am passing the head node and here i am checking that if node equals to null or node of next node null then return true it means that if there is only one node also so there, that is palindrome so i will return true else i will take two pointers slow pointer and fast pointer and i will initialize by one the node then i am taking a stack and where i am check where i am telling that this uh, the stack will contain the node property right now i am i am pushing the first node which is the slow node which is first node and i am checking that so this is basically to calculate the middle node so i'm checking that if fast dot next is not null and fast dot next dot next is not null increase the slow by one position and fast by two position and once we are doing this so also put the also push the the slow pointer into stack right so basically you can understand what i'm doing i'm putting the first half into stack right and then i will match these stacks to the second half right so i'm pushing the element as well when i am doing and now they are done so now i'm checking if fast dot next is null so whenever fast dot next is null it means it has odd nodes if it is not null it means it has even nodes right so now you can see what is first first is 99 and the next is not null so in this case i won't do anything i won't pop out and the second half will be slow for next so now it will go here and it will iterate the loop until the second half is not null so now what i am doing i am checking that 
pop out the elements from this tag and this is a data and check with the data of the second half right so if it if if at any point they are not equal then return false else increase the second half by one position which is next right again it will check so again it will say yes both are matching so nothing again they are matching and at the last it will return true right so you can see here it is printing true now let me show you an example where i have the odd nodes so in this case what will happen that here is the same procedure that first it is checking now we have the five elements in this uh, the three elements in this tag and now you can see the next of fast is null it means we have odd nodes so i will first pop out the one element right now stack has two element and now it will pop out and check whether the elements are matching again it will check yes elements are matching and now it will return true right so you can see they have written true now let's say that uh, we have the list but they are not matching so let's say i have here is 13 so in this case what would happen it should return false so it will go here it will do this it will check the second half and now at the last here in this case it is returning false because the elements are not matching one is 12 and one is 13 so we'll get the result as 12 right so that's the logic of the if palindrome that whether the elements are palindrome or not and the complexity is big of n basically and uh, we are we have taken the auxiliary space of this tag so which is basically n by 2 you can say so n by 2 or n is the auxiliary space and the complexity is big of n overall so that's it guys for this video and if you have any issues or if you have understood the problem then please write in the comment section and if you like the problem then please like the video and subscribe the channel for more such problems thank you